If you'd like to tap into a free source of veritably unlimited power to fuel your progress in life, keep watching. Because I'm going to share a perspective and a practice that just might change the game for you. By the way, I'm Michael Ravenwood, and I'm an empowerment coach that throws real lightning bolts. So if you enjoy what I share in this video and you want to transform your life in 90 days, go ahead and use the link in the bio or message me. So the perspective I'm sharing is that love is a renewable energy. Now we recognize the other forms of renewable energy by the way that they are part of nature that are just radiating power. Each of the primal elements has energy just bursting from it. The sun is fire, geothermal energy from the earth, and there's tidal wave power and also wind power. And I'm suggesting that we recognize that we're part of nature too. And the thing that we experience inside, which is associated with radiant energy just bursting from us, is the experience of love. Now, romantic love is perhaps the most powerful kind, being that it is behind the progeneration of our entire species. Yet I'm talking about more than just this. I'm talking about the kind of love when we're around our friends or our family, or the kind of love when we're doing the kinds of things that we just love to do. Think about it. If we're tired at the end of a long day, exhausted, we think that nothing more would be wonderful for us than sleep, and then a friend calls and tells us that down the street, at a local club, our favorite band is playing. Suddenly we leap up with alacrity, throw on our clothes, and dance the whole night through. Where did that energy come from? It came from love. Or if you're working on a passion project and you're just cranking away, and suddenly you look up and six hours have passed, and you think to yourself, where did I get all that energy? It felt totally effortless. That came from love. So the way we can turn this perspective into a practice is to inventory the things that we really love, journal about them every night, every day, at the end of the day, write down what it was that filled your heart with joy. Make sure you bring more of that into your life. And if you are in a career that you don't love or there's no part of it that you love, you may want to find a new one. Because if you want to work effortlessly for the rest of your life, you've got to be doing something that you really love. When we find a way to do what we really love, create value for others, and then receive money from that, then we're in the sweet spot of where our career is serving us. So I hope the perspective of viewing love as a renewable energy source and the practice of inventorying in your life what it is that you really love and making sure to bring more of that into your schedule and into your life has been helpful. And if that message did land for you, put love power in the comments. If you put love power in the comments, I'll know I did my job. And if you happen to want to transform your experience of life in 90 days, use the link in the bio or message me.